If you've been to the zoo recently, you may have wondered what happened to the seals. They were moved out of sight to make way for construction, but we've learned those seals may not be coming back. News 13's Chris McKee found out why, and he is live tonight at the zoo. Chris? Yeah, Dean, for about the last nine months, the zoo's three seals have actually been living in a couple of temporary tanks behind the scenes. Now, we learned that the city has been looking for a new home for these animals, but they haven't found one yet. Good. Up. A fan favorite at the zoo for years. Good. Albuquerque's three harbor seals drew big crowds. Oh, yes, people love them. Today, their old tank is empty and the seals are nowhere to be found. Their old exhibit is going to be part of the Australia domain that's coming in. But that doesn't mean the seals. Hello, beautiful. Have left Albuquerque just yet. We are behind the scenes at the facility that we have built for the seals. <laughs> Baby, Feisty and Gracie, all three are actually still here just not in a place where you can see them. We continue to care for and love them and help them thrive where they are here with us. Erin Flynn is the Bioparks mammal curator. She says the seals are in a staff only area of the Biopark with two big pools and a deck. They get a lot of obviously fresh air, beautiful sunshine. The nine month old area is still considered temporary, but it's unlikely these seals will return to public view. The city isn't actively working on building a new seal enclosure inside the zoo right now. Instead, they're trying to find the seals a new home in a zoo or aquarium in another city, which hasn't been easy. You have stepped away from harbor seals because they themselves are not critically endangered. With no timetable on when the seals could get a new home, they'll be living behind the scenes for now. They are deeply loved, they are deeply cared for, and we are working with other zoos to help find a really good place for them to go. Now, the seal's old enclosure here at the zoo is set to be demolished. There's no exact date on when that will happen, but probably be sometime next year. It was actually closed in late January after federal animal inspectors actually determined that that facility needed serious repair if they were to keep using it. Back to you. All right, Chris, thank you. Well, the city had plans for a new seal enclosure and the master plan that came out five years ago, but at $25 million, it is unlikely to happen anytime soon because the biopark has other projects they say are higher priorities.